Alright, uh, the dude is silver 6. Wait, how many silvers are there? I checked up ranking and I figured out that uh, it's broken. Basically, there is one guy who cheated or somehow he just uh, hacked uh, the leaderboards and now he's the first. I don't know how many more did that. But ranking overall in this game was kind of uh, useless. My name is Weishnin. It would do you well to remember it. Know your place, trash. Okay, so there is one problem with Vice that I found. Uh, basically, yeah, she's an amazing character when you play her normally, but she has black glyphs. And in order to use her black glyphs and traps, if you don't know, uh, her traps basically just an obstacle in the way that allow you to corner people, and her black glyphs allow you to jump from them in order to, I don't know, just look really flipping cool. But the problem with both of those moves is that this game is incredibly high paced and those have insane amount of uh, casting time or active frames. By the time you put them on screen, your opponent is already on your face. So you probably have to do it on a knockdown, but the game doesn't have knockdown that is hard enough to pull all of this off. So you have to place a glyph and just hope that one day it may be useful to something. You know, there is no reason to actually use any of those moves, because normal-wise is just as strong. Now about Jin. Jin is dead. <laughs> so I guess we're gonna come back with Vice. Anyway, the reason why I told you that is because, uh, you know, I'm gonna try and play Vice normally right now. But I will be low-key trying to upgrade my skills in using black glyphs and traps in order to do some cool shit in later videos. Assuming there will be some. Okay, double super was not a good idea. That's a happy birthday. If you didn't notice, I'm trying to parry. Not working out for now. Oh! I still can't believe there is no legit uh, interaction between Jin and Vice. I mean, they're both are uh, ice queens. Uh, I mean, Jin Jin is not very friendly. Let's say it like that. But get out of my sight, eyesore. Hard boiled. <laughs> now you're talking like a man. Can't escape from crossing fate. She has an interaction with Blake, which is a weird choice. I mean, they gave uh, him interaction with Blake, but not with Vice. Overall, I think both of those characters are pretty strong. I mean, they even work together pretty damn well in the combos. But the coolest part about them, at least with Jin, is that whenever opponent is blocking, you get this uh, pseudo 50 50. I mean, it's kind of uh, almost impossible to react on the overhead online. And Vice is great on setting up the overhead itself. At least that's how I feel. God damn, it's so hard to punish that because the range of my sword is not huge enough. I have to run in really close in order to punish this crazy scythe. And then there is uh, also a possibility of support hitting me. Oh no, it has begun. It has begun! It has begun! I'm getting Gordoed. I'm getting Gordoed, oh my god. Thanks god that's over. Okay, annoying stuff stopped. Mm -hmm. Or did it? Oh my god, has two more meters. This is the end! Uh, possibly. Oh. Yeah, I really wanted that end. I wield the power of order, the force that keeps this world in balance. You stand no chance against me. Let us both 
let's fight fair. Call my name and I shall appear. Mm, I don't know what your name is, but uh, I know what Jin would have called you. Jin is incredibly rude. I mean, uh, the Persona girl, she's very nice lore-wise, but is very annoying gameplay-wise. I don't know, at least for me. I don't really like those Vata characters, despite being one of the few good players with Duelist Lukang in MK. You dare strike me? The glorious Jean? God damn it, I tried to spawn the black glyph. See, that's the problem. Even when the character has no range, it's because everyone can run. The amount of screen available for you is too short. You're not able to do the setups. Or at least, you know, to spawn stuff that you need to spawn. I need to figure out how to do proper uh, combos that give me enough knockdown for this. But I'll deal with it later. Maybe I'll do some Blake videos, I don't know. Shit! I can't even deny! No give up! The reason why it's so easy to make comebacks in this game is because every super does like 30% damage. Oh, that was too close to combo, man! This might be almost it. Woo! <laughs> the damage is right there! They have Ragna. Uh, Jean and uh, Ragna have this uh, weird lower relationship. Uh, I'm not sure I can uh, properly explain it. I guess if I had to explain it with one word. Izanagi. <laughs> guess that's one idea. Let me work with you. I won't be able to do this otherwise. Oh, do whatever you want. Just don't fall behind. Then we're a team. Now, let's, let's go. go. The fuck? Why they have such a cool intro? You. And you is everywhere. He's uh, the third most popular character. Aside of uh, Gordo and Ruby. God damn it. He's really strong, probably. I don't know. I've never played this character, but I assume he's strong because everyone's playing him. <laughs> Give me my Nissan. Or my brother. Nissan. Here we go, brother! All the best combos for you. You. One more and you're dead, brother. Nani? Why did you switch? Oh my god! I think the one of the coolest skills you can have in this game is to be able to predict switches and anti-air properly, like base your combo in a way that they switch straight into your anti-air and you get another combo. I think it's easier to do with... Oh my god, my gene died. I think it's easier to do with... Uh, Blake, but it's possible with every character. I reversal, but he reversaled in the middle of my reversal, the fuck? Time for another comeback. You didn't die from that? Come on. This is going to be hard. I can't believe this is getting people sometimes. <laughs> uh, just one really sharp super. And we're done here. I'm going for the back glyph. No grabs. Let's do some. I got destroyed! That's so cool though. Okay, so I want to do Jean's uh, 
Astral. I'm not sure if that's the same one as he had before in Central Fiction, because uh, I don't remember Gina at all, but um, I'm pretty sure it is. However, if, if it is, then it looks cool. The first thing I'm gonna do is call partner. I don't need a partner. Partner, come! I love Jean. He's uh, a troll. Uh, he's a specifically character designed to be rude, but in a trolley way, you know? Just so that uh, the viewers would have fun, not because he is actually evil. I had no idea what I meant with that jab. I'm doing a bad job, wait. Oh, too slow, I was too slow. Man, my vice. It's because I'm concentrated on Jean. You see, when you concentrate on one character, the other one suffers. Just can't get marvelous. It depends on the connection, though. If it's perfect, then I'm getting marvelous almost all the time. Oh, so bad, so bad, so bad. I have weird decisions sometimes. He just full comboed my fucking support and then back hit me. That's a crime. My lord, Ruby, please. Time to die. Oh my god, I didn't have enough meter. No, wait. Now is time to die. I wanna see if I can do Vice's um, combo into instant kill. She just hunt here at both of them, I just realized. The fuck? Sword! Sword, come on! It was the best setup ever. I guess I just didn't do it in time. No marvelous. Shadow clone? Not at all. I probably could have converted out of that. And he's mashing a lot. I know the right normals. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Very chaotic person. Wow. I, uh, I sometimes mess up between uh, his back light and the normal light uh, auto combo. I still can't believe that this game is based on auto combos. I mean, you have to use counter auto combos a lot in order to do normal combos. Alright, 9 bars of meter and we're finished here. It does need a bit of timing though, so... Hope we're gonna end this with elegance and style of the Schnee family.